one can get flown. <laughs> Give me the victim's first name. Manny. All right. It's got to be good. I, I can tell from your voice. It is. <laughs> All right. Lay it on me. Okay. He's this guy in our aerobics class, and he's really embarrassing because he doesn't wear any underwear, and he gives everybody a free show, and we want you to kind of get him kicked out of the class, give him a real scare. Oh, God. <laughs> he, he doesn't wear anything under his gym shorts. Nothing. Oh, boy. Baggy shorts. <laughs> and you, you haven't been looking, have you, Roberta? You can't help but look. Yeah. <laughs> All right. How, how do you know this guy? We work in the same office together. Oh, boy. All right, well, let's call Manny. Hello? Call it for Manny, please. Speaking. Yeah, Manny, this is Bob over here at the gym. You know where the aerobics class is? Oh, yeah, yeah. How's Did, it going? Well, we got a problem. Some ladies had turned you in because uh, you were in their aerobics class, and they said that, that you uh, had been exposing yourself in the class. Exposing myself? Yeah, do you, do you know what that means? Oh, well, yeah, but I... They said that you you wore no uh, underwear under your gym shorts, no underwear, and that when you jog up and down and everything, that it was just pretty well grossing them out. Well, oh, what, have they been looking or what? Well, they said they couldn't help it, that uh, it's just terrible and that uh, you, you looked like you intentionally did this and then asked me to get you out of the class. What? You mean some lady there said that she saw me hanging out of my trunks? Yeah. What is this? Well, uh, that's what she said, and I, uh, I, you know, I have to kick you out of the aerobics class because they, uh, I have no reason to doubt these women. And uh, what do you mean, kick me out? Can, you know, here these these. What, excuse me, sir. Can you not wear some underwear when you're jogging up and down, or is, uh, some type of strap in there? Hey, man, what is this, man? If I want my pet to hang out all over the floor, that's my business, man. God. Well, now, don't I don't think you ought to be using that language to me on the telephone now. Hey, well, I'm. Pissed. First of all, you're calling me in the early in the morning and telling me all this bullshit. You know, about my, you know, my dog hanging out. That's my business, man. I mean, what about these fat bimbos over there with all their d hanging out and their ass hanging out? God. Are well, you talking about the women? Well, yeah. Who else? Well, now, I pers personally don't appreciate the fact that you said that you like to have your d hanging out on the floor like that. Now. I bet I they like it, too. What's that, sir? I, I said I bet they like it, too. Well, they've been reporting you, so they obviously don't like it at all. Oh, I don't believe this, man. You know, come on, Bob, man. Now, you're out of the class, and I, I can see that they said that your attitude would be bad about this. I think that you're an exhibitionist and that you've been trying to show yourself to these women. Hey, f*** you, man. You know what? If, if they're tired of, of seeing me hang out in my trunks, the next time I go down there, I'm going to drop my drawers right there and just jog around the place so all them women can get hot and bothered. Cause you know that's what's really going on, man. We don't appreciate that attitude, sir. Hey, well, no. tough sh Man, you guys are full of it. <laughs> well, nah, I don't appreciate that. And you know, something that you may not appreciate is that you're untended phone and... Oh. <laughs> is this Rick Dees? Yes. Oh, God. <laughs> you had <asshole. laughs> <laughs> 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 so bad. <laughs>